Hi there, my name is Angela and I'm a part of the QuickBooks Advanced Reporting team. Today I'm going to talk about using list boxes to connect your data and build reports. We've covered this a bit in the dynamic filtering video when we talked about using list boxes to filter your data. Now we're going to see how this relates to how you make connections within your reports. So an easy way to use advanced reporting is to start with a template that most closely matches what you want to see and add list boxes to sift through the data for you. This tool links data that you may not associate with each other. So let's say you want to see some information that has to do with customer jobs. Well, start with a customer list template. And this template comes with a pivot style table, the large one that you see in the middle, and three different list boxes for state, city, and active customer. Let's check out some of the data in this table. And we'll specifically look at a dimension. The pivot table has customer full name as the dimension, and you can see it lists out the job with the customer. You would find that here by first selecting customer and then going up into here and looking for a full name. But maybe you want to see which vendors were used with different customers. All you would need to do is add a vendors list box. It's in the library already built for you. Since advanced reporting automatically links this data together, you simply have to click on the name of the vendor you want to see the customer associated with. This vendor is the first option here, so let's see if there's any customers that use this vendor. And it looks like two jobs that are currently at a zero balance. You can also see that the city list box changed too. They are highlighted in white because it's associated with what is showing in the table. These customers were in Middlefield and Bayshore, California. You can see that in the state. Now you think that you want to see what items were associated with these jobs and vendors. Just add the items list box. So let's say today you'd like to know if any of these customers have the item appliance associated with them. Once you click appliance, it brings up those customers and you can also see here that McLean Appliances was the vendor that was used for that job. Okay, so that's it for this video. Thanks for watching and if you have any questions, please let us know. Bye for now.